This is the instructional video for plastic welding technologies MAK48 and MAK58 extrusion welders. The machine comes complete with a Teflon shoe, a standle, mounting hardware, preheat nozzles, a handle, and instruction manual. Start with the standle assembly. Locate the mounting bracket and the standle mounting stud. Screw the short threaded end of the stud with the spring into the bracket. Find the standle and screw cap. Lift the extruder and mount them to the stud. When tightening, make sure the serrated teeth lock together. Adjust the standle to a comfortable position. An optional handle can be used in place of the standle. Find the custom handle ring and screw the handle in. While loose, position the handle and then tighten to lock. The MAK48 and 58 come with a standard preheat or an optional 360 degree swivel preheat. Hot air in the swivel preheat flows down to the shoe and can be positioned to weld in any direction. Loosen the Allen screw to adjust or remove the shoe and preheat guide. The standard preheat nozzle can be changed depending on the width of the weld you're doing. Just loosen the screw and replace the nozzle. The Teflon shoe can easily be replaced as well. Loosen the 6mm set screw, pull off the shoe, replace it, and tighten it down. Start the machine by connecting to a 220 volt power supply. The display menu will light up. Select the welding material you use by pressing the down and up arrows. Press the check button to confirm your choice. Next, select the rod size you'll be using and press the check button to confirm. Use the down arrow to select the material temperature. The small highlighted number is the set temperature. The large number is the actual temperature. Adjust with the up and down arrows. Press the check button. Use the up arrow to select the air temperature. Again, adjust with the up and down arrows and use the check button to save the selection. The lower left corner of the display shows the word OFF. When it changes to ON, the material will be heated. You can activate the drive motor and begin welding. To cool down the gun, push the back arrow button for the main menu. Welding rod feeds into the extruder from the side of the barrel. Two adjustment screws help control the feed for different size rod as well as softer rod. The trigger lock button is located down on the handle. Push to lock the trigger in place. To unlock, squeeze the trigger once. Before welding, you might want to tack your material in place using a quick L or other hot air tool. Heat up the machine and run it until the extradite becomes smooth.
Lay down a steady bead of plastic as you move the extruder along the welding path in the direction of the preheat. After the weld, make sure to cool down the machine. Thank you for using PWT's MAK48 and MAK58.